just want to do this quick rap about some cartoons that I watched as a kid. Hope you guys like it. So once upon a time back in the first grade, I would sit around and watch the television all day. Eyes glued to the screen, no breaks in between. Try to name. Okay, you beautiful passengers, welcome back to the back of this semi truck. And if you are a new passenger around here, fair warning. When it comes to me and doing reactions, I am a very verbal reactor. I talk a lot during the reactions. I, I I just talk a lot during the reactions, and I verbally let it be known what I'm thinking in my head as the show is going on. So, fair warning, <laughs> if anyone has those comments down there, shut up. I'm trying to watch the show. Go to Rooster Teeth and watch the show over there, because this is a reaction channel. You've got to be able to have a reaction in order to call yourself a reaction channel. So, <laughs> so yes, um, getting that out the way first. And with Steven Universe ending, I thought that this might be a really good show to go ahead and tackle next. I've never watched anything remotely close to doing anything like this on this channel. I know this isn't an anime, but this is the closest we've been so far to an anime. And if I dip my toes into this show, maybe I could start dipping my show toes into another show that's closer to anime and start getting closer and closer to that, but at the same time keep continue watching American shows as well. Um but with that said, when I added this show, I really wanted to do a show that had creators who were very reaction friendly. And from what I've seen on their guidelines, Rooster Teeth is a very good company to work for. Not work for, but work with, as in doing reactions and fan made stuff and stuff like that. So this is a series I've been wanting to ca you know, catch and just check out and stuff like that. And then I saw that there was four trailers, red, black, yellow, um, and whatever the other color was, white, R-W-B-Y, duh, um, <laughs> but yeah, I wanted to, because I had problems there at the end of Steven Universe with Warner Brothers, and I refused to do any reactions to their shows anymore, so I wanted to work with creators that actually valued fans and valued the reactors and stuff like that, so here we are with Rooster Teeth's R-W-B-Y, um, I don't know, for some reason when I see the show's name, RWBY, for some reason the first thought that clicks in my head is like Ruby. I don't know if that's like, you know, another name for the show or maybe it's another pronunciation. I have no idea, but um, as you can tell from the community tab, we're about to start this and I figured I better start with the trailers. So that's what I'm doing. I'm starting with the trailers and I really thought this was a show... That all the fans of Steven Universe would like as well. And I wanted to continue along the same lines of something that, that I think they would like as well. And I know I say it every time. But if you can hear that airplane, that's the location we're at tonight with this semi-truck. So, with that said, this is the right ear. This is the left ear. Three, two, one, and play. Rooster Teeth Presents... Okay, and what I know, they are very, a new series by Monty O-U-M, um, Om, I don't know how to pronounce that. From what I know about Rooster Teeth, though, they don't like their stuff cut up too much. So, I'm not going, this is very good music, mind you, by the way. I'm not going to be editing these reactions down if they don't want me to. I've read in the guidelines. And th they're a very friendly company. That's beautiful animation right here. Granted, it feels slow and methodical, but those trees in the background are very beautiful. Okay. Let the beast descend from shadows is one of our lyrics, I think. Oh, really? Okay, so obviously this is red. 
What? Oh, I got blood in this series? Okay. I can get down with this. This is a new, this is a new thing for this channel. Okay. Oh. Well, we got a sickle. Slice his head off. Oh, yes. Okay. And instead of blood, it's rose petals going up, I've noticed. Okay, this is very ima imaginative. I like this. Now, I can't tell by this little trailer here what exactly the story is going to be. But this is very good stuff. And it's as if we're watching a video game right now. Oh, I was about to say, just, just pull that trigger, girl. Uh, how many beasts are there? Oh, and yes, I fair warned y'all, I'm a talkative reactor. Really? There's that many more beasts? Okay, we've got... To get... Okay, so we're obviously going to get very violent with this series. But, we don't have blood. I thought we had blood at first, but it was nothing but rose petals going up in the air like it is now. But we're obviously going to be getting very violent with this series. So, that's something that's different than what we normally have on this channel. So, that's pretty good. Okay, what's the next one? I'm presuming we're going to the trailer for White. Everyone is entitled to their own sorrow for the heart. Oh, why do I have to be such a slow reader? Okay, so we're going to White. Okay, and this stuff is very music heavy. From what I know about Rooster Teeth, they release the claims, if there is a claim. And, you know, since I'm using the whole thing, I don't mind if they claim me. Okay. So... I could tell we're using a lot of piano in this series. Okay, so are you about to beat up some stuff too? Oh. This is different. I was about to say with all the piano going on, I was about to say maybe my wife could do like a, you know her own version of one of these songs, but I don't know now. Okay, I don't think you're doing that much damage to this guy. He kind of reminds me of Shredder with his face mask, though. I'm surprised you got hit. Oh, Red didn't get hit. What, are we already done with that trailer? No, there ain't no way. I mean, we got 18 minutes worth of trailers here. Okay, I like this music. It's starting to feel very video game-ish. And I've been playing a lot of Final Fantasy VII lately. Not the remake, by the way. Old school Final Fantasy 7. So I, I, I'm feeling the music. And I'm liking that. Slide down that sword. Okay, so you got magic. Okay. That's interesting.
Okay. Not quite as epic as red, but still pretty fun. I know there's like one of these trailers that has like five minutes. And as I can tell, there's lots of music involved in this. So obviously I'm going to be doing, you know, songs. Okay. So we're not done with you? You defeated your enemy. Okay, so now we're going to go from... We did red and white. Now we're going to... I wanted to say blue because, of course, I got Steven Universe on my mind. And I, I think of the diamonds from that series. But obviously, we're going to go to black. So, what do we got here? Now, your hopes have become my... Why did you take it off the screen so fast? <laughs> wow. Now, if I didn't know any better, we were still sticking with red, but I could see that you're wearing all black. So, cool beans. We're on black now. Blake. Oh. It's time. Blake. Okay. Okay, so this is the first voice acting that I'm getting. That's cool. So what do we got going on? Is this like a train heist? Okay. So here's our music with this one. We're gonna be doing this the hard way. Ah! Don't be so dramatic. Intruder, identify yourself. Okay, so I don't know who he is, but I'm liking him so far. No nonsense, I like it. Let's fight, y'all. <laughs> okay. There has got to be a video game for this series. I could just tell by this kind of animation and this kind of fighting style that they got going on. It's got like a Dynasty Warriors feel to it with the fighting style. Or at least for the first trailer, Red, and this trailer here. Okay, and as far as the music, is the music original to the series is what I'm wondering now. Because it's very rock feel to it. Oh, let's see. How can I say it? Very... Uh, I don't know how to describe it. Early 2000s rockish? Move up to the next car. I'll set the charges. What about the crew members? What about them? What about them? <laughs> that was right. Adam. Okay. This one here we need to get out of here. ain't no joke. He's there to kill you. Oh! Wait, and y'all barely took any damage? Find me some time. Are you sure? Do it. Are you doing anything to this thing? Nothing? This definitely seems like a Final Fantasy boss to me.
Okay, so... What's with all the pedals? That looks like something from Red. Bye. Well, what'd you do that for? Okay, so now we go on over to yellow. See the premiere? Obviously, it's already premiered. Huh. Okay, so now we'll go to yellow. Come on now, let's do this. Hopefully this time I can catch the quote. I'm going to watch for it. <laughs> Come on. Oh, there's no way I could catch this. Scathing eyes ask that. Whatever. Okay. Okay, I'm telling y'all, this music definitely feels like music from when I was a teenager. Not early 2000s, but yeah, yeah, maybe early 2000s, very late 90s. So yeah, we got a bear being a DJ. I know he had a mask on, but still. Strawberry sunrise, no ice. Okay. Aren't you a little young to be in this club, Blondie? <laughs> Aren't you a little old to have a name like Junior? So you know who I am. You got a name, sweetheart? <laughs> yes, Junior. I've got several. But instead of sweetheart, you could just call me Sir. Whoa! People say you know everything. <gasps> Tell me where I can find her and I'll Ooh. let you go. I've never seen her before. I swear. Excuse who is that? Is that black? I swear. Well, Blake, whatever you want to call it. Have an audience. This must be kind Not of it. But you know what I mean, y'all. Uh, awkward. Listen, Blondie, sir, if you want to make it out of this club alive, I suggest you let me go now. Ugh. You'll pay for that. Oh, Junior, I was just playing with you. Don't be so sensitive. Come on, let's kiss and make up, okay? Huh? <laughs> okay. Yes. <laughs> I don't think, yeah, I was about to say, dude, it doesn't work that way. <laughs> it's not just going to be a playful little banter and kiss and make up. Oh, I like her weapons. They're like shotguns, y'all better be careful. Oh, that's different than a shotgun. Okay. So our little bear DJ got himself a little machine gun. Yeah. Um. Not no more. This girl. I don't know Milsha, but we should teach her a lesson. <laughs> okay. Are you really gonna teach her a lesson?
Oh! I was about to say, she found her in to just knock you out. Really? Man, how many daggone bullets you got in that thing? Uh, okay, I'll give the credit where credit's due. They are very inventive when it comes to weapons on this this little show. <laughs> Oh, he got a little bit of her hair, didn't he? Okay. So who's this red cape? Yang? Is that you? Oh, hey, sis. What are you doing here? <laughs> okay. So, it was you she was looking for, huh? Okay. So, with that said, well, not with that said, but with that, with all that, <laughs> that was the trailer for Red, White, Black, slash Blake, what, whoever her name is, and Yellow. Um, <laughs> okay, so, what kept me away from this show for so long was... I didn't know if the girls in this show would be scantily clad or not. And the closest we get to scantily clad was yellow. And it could be a little bit less showy, honestly. But I'm presuming that it's not going to be like that throughout the whole series. So I'll continue to give it a shot. And the rest of them, psh, nothing to it. So, I was fairly surprised that they didn't show more than they did. I was glad about that, definitely. Um, as far as the last one, Yellow. She was obviously looking for Red. I don't know their names yet. So, the only one I think we know the name for is Black, which is Blake. So, I'm just calling them by the colors. Yellow was obviously looking for Red. Um, I don't know what Blake slash Black was doing, nor do I know what the story is behind White. But, at least I know that Red and Yellow are sisters. And, hmm, I don't know what that means, though. So, yeah. Um, other than that, though, um, animation-wise. <sighs> animation-wise, this will take some getting used to for me. It's... You know, like when I started watching Dragon Prince, the animation was a little bit slower because, you know, they were doing less frames per minute, not per minute, less frames per second, and that took me a little while to get used to, and by the end of the first season, I was very used to that on the Dragon Prince, and I, I liked it a lot. And then on the second season, they picked up the frame rate, and I was to the point that I was so used to the first season that I didn't mind that, you know, from... you. Know, I didn't mind the first season's animation compared to the second and third season of The Dragon Prince. And this is, in a sense, not exactly the same, but in a sense, this is kind of the same aspect that I'm going to be getting used to this one. Just because the frame rate seems a little bit, you know, seems like they're doing a few frames less than normal per second. And that's cool. That's cool. You know, you do what you gotta do. The animation looks cool. I like it. It's just gonna take me, you know, a, little, a few episodes to get used to it. So, yeah, I like the animation. It's unique. It's different. And I'm the kind of person who likes unique and different things. So, that works out for me. Um, Storyline? I have no idea what the story is, so I can't go by that. Voice acting? Mm, that'll take some getting used to. Like I said at the beginning, this is the closest that I've been to anime type stuff. So when it comes to the voice acting, I know it's going to be a little bit different, you know, voice acting wise. So like I said, it'll be, you know, getting used to. 
So, yeah. Um, hmm. Other than that. Okay. Um, now I need to know, if y'all have made it this far, what is the name of the first episode? <laughs> because this seems to be a series... I'm presuming that the name of the first episode... I want to be sure I watch this stuff in order is the reason why I'm asking. I've seen in some places where it has, from the bottom up, there's this thing called Remnants of War, I believe. I don't want to have... You know, I want to be able to start from the very beginning. And if Remnants of War was the first, you know, series, then I want to start there. I'm presuming this trailer is the first series. But I believe... And on top of that, what else is confusing is I don't know if this is... You know, do they go in volume one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, however many they go to, or are they seasons? Season one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, whatever they go to there. Because in some places I catch them listed as season one, two, three, blah, 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 blah. Or in some places it's listed as volume. And in some places it's listed as volume one, season two, three, four, volume five. It's confusing on the way they've done this. So. I think the name of the first episode that I need to watch is called Ruby Rose. I'm not 100% sure, but that's what I'm believing. Um, not 100% sure. So, yeah. Um, <laughs> other than that, um, obviously I've got a message to check now thanks to whatever noise we just heard. I'll pick that up in a minute and check it out later. Other than that, um, yeah, I might go ahead and, as of recording this, watching, you know, episode one tomorrow. I'm not 100% sure if I will or not. And then, I don't know. I don't know when I'm going to watch, you know, the next episode or not. But... Hopefully, Rooster Teeth is a good company to react to because from what I read on their guidelines, as long as you make it free to watch, you can monetize it from what they say on their guidelines. You can monetize it, but it has to still be free to watch even with that ad. Like it normally, I'll play an ad at the beginning and the end of something, you know, cool beans. I never put any ads in the middle because it just ruins the flow of the reaction, y'all. So, yeah, they allow you to react to full episodes as long as you make it free and available to watch. If they claim it, cool beans, you know, earn a few pennies off me. I don't mind. Y'all know what to do from here. Hit that like, tickle to subscribe, don't be texting and driving, and as Mr. Rogers always says. And I like you as you are. I do.